colorful personalities with a knack for showmanship. But it's also a rough, tough world where the show can take a serious, even deadly turn. That was the fate of one of wrestling superstars, Frank Goodish, better known to fans as Bruiser Brody. He was murdered last month in Puerto Rico. Bruiser Brody! Bruiser Brody was one of the last of wrestling's great independents, a self-made tough guy star who shunned affiliation with the big pro wrestling federations so that he could do it his way. His way meant traveling the world to wrestle. Brody was the number one foreign wrestling attraction in Japan. The fans in Japan, um, the wrestling fans in Japan, truly believed that Bruiser Brody was the toughest man to walk the face of the earth. They really did. I'd say on an international basis, you know, with the exception of probably Hulk Hogan, he may have been the most well-known wrestler around the world. His last wrestling trip took him to San Juan, Puerto Rico. In the dressing room before a match, Brody was knifed in the abdomen. He died hours later. This man, another wrestler named Jose Gonzalez, better known to fans as Invader One, was arrested for the murder and awaits trial. It's the first case of a murder connected with professional wrestling. But one wrestling superstar who left the game says the potential for real violence has always been there. You know, wrestlers are a real, rambling, uh, tough kind of people. Uh, the last of the warriors are gladiators. They, they have nothing on their side. The only thing they've got is rah! You know, and if that ain't good enough, you lose. So um, that's the way they live. <laughs> has moved to the safer world of making movies. He remembers too well what it was like wrestling in Puerto Rico. I was stabbed three times uh, and shot at. Uh, you, you get into a frame of mind where you, a wrestler isn't the guy to be messing with uh, at all because he knows how to do it all. And uh, that's where Brody was coming from, I'm sure. And that's who the guys that were fighting him were coming from. And when you take this, these two forces that have disagreement before they get there... <laughs> The wrestling game will find other tough, willing big men to take their knocks and fill the fight card, but by his fans worldwide, Bruiser Brody will be missed. There's very few people who I would say are key figures who, when they are gone, there's a real void. And, and Brody was one of them, without a doubt, you know, especially in Japan, but also in the United States, also in Puerto Rico. <laughs> We'll have more on Rowdy Roddy Piper's film debut in weeks to come.